Okay, look, last time it was food, all right? So this time, spice it up, change it up. Last time? Yeah, last time. Nothing in between? No. Nope. That's right. It was just, this was recorded immediately after. No, no, no. We have the same live studio audience member. He's still here. He's, he's, yes, he's, he's shocked. He's shocked to know. Uh, maybe we'll surprise him with this after. Maybe I'll tell him, maybe I won't. Well, it depends on when we get him home in time. It was really difficult getting him over here with you. With all that, the, uh, the traffic and the fuel prices, and, uh... uh the fuel, the very topical, very to and, and this definitely didn't happen within the last... No. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, of okay. time. Just immediately broken the illusion of, yeah, it was recorded immediately. No, no, this is, like, a couple of weeks later. Whoops. Yeah. But there's been a, been a lot happening in the meantime. I think the biggest news of today, of uh, the whole month, I think, the biggest news of the month, out of all the updates of... Between February and March 2022, the big, absolute biggest thing that's happened is Elon Musk had a daughter with a surrogate. Uh, okay, yeah, awesome. yeah, yeah. I was going to disagree on what the news was, but we can talk about this before. That's, that's the biggest news that, 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 of the, the year. What was the name again? Oh, name one geopolitical thing that's happened in the last four days. Nah, you're right. You're right. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> So, wait, how many kids does Elon Musk have again? Like seven. I think oh. it is seven. Right, and you said he had four businesses before? CEO of four businesses. All right, he'll either get to four kids or seven <laughs> seven kids or four businesses or maybe he'll stop there. Maybe, maybe he won't. Who knows? I'm saying he should just... <laughs> my point is he should round out the numbers. Of course. Yeah. Uh, now, whichever, whichever way it goes. You can use fractions. Yeah. <laughs> you don't have to use fractions. They're both whole numbers. Well, it's... What? Or does seven goes? How does seven go into four? I didn't say they they would go were dividable numbers. I said they were both whole numbers. Okay, well, yeah. Four uh, is a full complete number. You said use fractions. Uh, Why would you use fractions? Okay. Well. Yeah. Your brain's I, a bit scrambled uh, there. Totally. Yeah, yeah. I believe her name is. Is it dark, Exa Dark Side Rail Musk or Dark Exa Side Rail Musk? I will. Exa Dark or Dark Exa? Verify by not using Google because that's a rule mm. on the show. And we've already used up Bing. Yeah, I, no. Oh, there was apparently. Yeah, I was looking before topics that DuckDuckGo has been cancelled. What do you mean being cancelled? It's cancelled. Like, oh, it's left wing media now or some shit. I don't know. The whole point is there is literally no touching of the algorithm by external forces. Yeah, but I think they touch the algorithm, and that's why, that's why it's cancelled. It was something like that. I don't know. I was going to bring it up. I was like, oh, no, fuck it. Why not? Like, well, they, t they touch it to a certain extent with certain things to, you know, remove crime. No, nah, you, know, you got to be completely impartial. Yeah, 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 yeah. It doesn't matter. Yeah. <laughs> how, to, how to kill and bury your next door neighbor. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> and get away with it. And get away with it, yes. That's, that's right. the search term. That's what you get. You're looking up the the, the, the pronunciation. I, I, I legitimately believe it's like Dark Exa. They, then they say it's pronounced Sidereal, I believe. Musk. Uh, not but it's Side sure. Rail. Daughter in the name. Yeah. Yeah, I forgot what I was uh, searching up like a couple seconds ago. Uh, welcome, second child. 15 hours ago. Here we go. This should be relevant. Elon Musk and Grimes baby girl name will make you say Y. They call her Y as well, just a heads up, like just the letter Y. That's what they're short, shorting it to. What? Uh. God, this is great. Oh, fuck, hang on. There's ads now. No, no, yeah. That, that, I'm telling you, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what they call it. Uh, continue reading. Extra dark... Exa? Yeah. Exa, yeah. Yeah, exactly. Exa, yeah, there you go. Exa dark side rail musk. Right. It's a... Yeah. Why is he doing stupid names? Well, once again, you, you, you can love Elon Musk. I like Elon Musk, you know, like... Obviously, I disagree with certain things, but that doesn't mean I can't like him. Yeah. But you, you cannot say he is he's the CEO of four companies and seven children and an amazing father. You can say he's a terrible, shitty CEO. Does a terrible job because I pay attention. He's a he's a relatively good father because there's seven. He's going to spread that out. Yeah, yeah. You can't not be a good father and have seven kids. Well, there's that too. Like, That's no, basically well, law. You could say he's an amazing father of seven kids, but you can't have four six, run the CEO of these four businesses. Or he's a great CEO, kind of terrible dad. Yeah. And then and then it's like, no, he could be a great dad. And then names his kid. Exa Dark Side well, Rail not, Musk. He, well, he's not making a good case for himself. It's right? middle name is Side Rail. He's giving his kids usernames <laughs> in like 10 years before I they actually think it. that's kind of genius. That's respectable. Yeah. Yeah. So you do right but there. They're condemned to just the same username. I see that. Yeah. Uh, I, I don't have anywhere else to take this conversation. Well, that's the thing. Like, as people, the kid will be born, but you have to register it immediately because 
Like, otherwise some person... Register the kid. It, register the username on, like, every platform. Gotcha, because okay. they can be, like, zero. So, I mean, within 13 years, someone else will have taken that. That's true. That's true. Okay, so he makes the, the accounts first, and then... That's probably that's probably what he should do. The other day, I reckon he did. Well, he went to go to... He's clicked the Generate Username button. Mm. <laughs> he's like, hmm, this'll do. Yeah, right Three there. times in a row. Listen up, Doc. Hmm. I got it. This is my idea. We hit the button three times. I don't put any thought into my daughter's names. No brain power is wasted. <laughs> I just click the generate button. I haven't got time. It's, I'm very busy. I got four companies and six other kids. <laughs> they all need my time and attention. Oh, man. All my companies, not the kids. They can deal with it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but to be fair, you can just buy love. And, you know. Hey, he has. And he can do that. Yes. He is the richest, yeah. Yes, he's like, but to be fair, is it buying your love? It's like, here you go, so it's like, Dad, I need to go to the movies. All right, here's six Tesla shares. So like, I can't give the, like, I probably can, but like, it's not the In transactable. In two weeks, you can, you can do it. <laughs> <laughs> that's why. That's why the kids have figured out. You got to ask if you want to go to the movies. You ask them two weeks before the movie comes out, and you get the tickets on opening night. I like that. It's great. Yeah, oh, let's just start living the life of being the the uh, not spouse, the offspring of a billionaire, trillionaire, billionaire. Billionaire. Okay, just checking. I don't know. I didn't keep up. But with once again, all of his stuffs in stocks. Like it's the the thing is that the, it's the, the thing that is dumb though is that they can literally just go, they're like no, I'm not selling. It's not paying any taxes. But they're like, all right, um, your bank. I want a load of like billions and billions of dollars and just take I it out too, again. Hang on, hang on. I too address my bank as yo bank. He probably does. <laughs> I would. I th actually, I yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm gonna try that. Go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go. Let's see how it's like. Hey, and yo bank, and they go, hey, just Tom. I like that. Go. That's right. Yeah. And the thing is, he's like. Yo, bank. I want like billions of dollars. Just give me a loan and a line of and a line of credit, and just put it against some stonks. And like, all right, sure. So he's got all this money, paid zero taxes, didn't sell anything. <laughs> that's, that's just the common strategy that they use. Yes. Yeah. yeah, yeah but just yeah. fair enough. I'd do that. Yeah. You just said you would. Yeah. yeah. So oh, I'm glad it's covered. Now you said that was the biggest news stories, but I purposely kept the secret from you so that we could revisit it. It's a. It's from. It's also from the previous episode that we recorded as well. Mm -hmm. So we made it a big point that uh, Bender was not coming back to Futurama. Mm, really. Yes, I, I, I did see this news. Well, now I mean, no, I didn't see it. This is oh, be wow, new to me. This is new. Yeah. Wow. Well, actually, he is coming back. They fixed the contract and shit. Uh, fuck it. Was it John DiMaggio? Yeah. John DiMaggio. John DiMaggio is the voice of Bender again. Apparently, what it was about. I'm not sure if we covered this last week. I think we spoke about him another reasoning. Um. Was that he? He was because well, people keep saying it's his. He's like, I'm not getting paid enough for this shit. Mm. But he was saying that the other people weren't getting paid enough, but they already accepted. But he's like, no, they're just saying that like the style draw, or whatever. Um, you need to pass all more, mm -hmm. and then unless like, we'll pay you more, he's like, no, no, unless you give us all more, then I'm not coming back to the show. So then apparently they did fix that up. Well, good then. Good means they will get their money's worth of. Show. Well, I mean, look, they they look like they enjoy the show. What is it? Was it 13 seasons? Uh, it's, it's actually not that many. Am I like it'd be like eight? We can search it up, or not. Or we can store what we do actually. I can use up. a cozier. Yeah. Plant a tree. Future Rava. Seasons. Mm -hmm. That should be fine. It's seven, but I'm saying that the room renewal would be eight. Okay. Is that correct? Yeah. Cool. Yeah, season seven, so there's the new episode. New seasons are season eight. That's what it says. Yeah. Yeah, good. Yeah. We were watching it before, and it's it's, uh, it's pretty good, actually. I tell you sure. Yeah. It's, um... Yeah, didn't... Didn't watch much. Like, watched it when it was on, but, you know. You know, what, you know what I see a lot of? What? I see tons of Family Guy clips, which we've spoken about before, but I mean, when I, I yeah, mean, not even on YouTube. No, no, I mean, specifically on TikTok now. Yeah. Uh, Don't see a lot of Futurama clips on TikTok. You know about TikTok being the, the fucking platform to just mine the brains of people? You, you use it a lot. So do you. A medium amount. Yeah, no. <laughs> he'll, he'll just send me like 17 TikTok or TikToks at and once. And they will all be fucked, but yeah. also funny. Yeah, but it's like watching a legitimate episode of a TV show because they all go for a minute each or something. Well, yes, maybe that's true, but that's the only time I use the app. And, I, and uh, when To I'm, use it a lot! When I'm using it, I'm very conscious of how much time is actually being wasted. You know when we were uh, sitting at the computer before? And we were both independently on our phones? I, we were both on TikTok, mm -hmm. right? That was half an hour of just wasted what do you mean wasted? Well, what do you mean? What do I mean wasted? What do you mean wasted? You it was weren't entertained. Was a time. Was it? Yes. When you entertained. I, I look. Yes, I send you a lot of uh, like fuck TikToks, but I am fully aware how much of a waste of time it is just sitting there on the platform. How? 
Why is it a waste of time? Because you could be doing anything else. But why is it a waste of time more than this podcast or going to the shops or doing different things? Like, what's, what, what, what is the difference maker? Okay, so the actual, the way that the platform is made is made to keep you in there forever. This has got a set time limit. Once it's over, it's over. And then you're doing something else? Yes. Okay, well, what's the difference between those two things? Because really? the, uh, the, it's the danger of not being definitive at the end. Like, this one you'll know. Once an hour is up, that's it. This is over. And then do what? And it's something else. Or another episode. Or another episode. Or just binge the whole series. That just series. the purpose of what you just said. Just listen to the whole podcast <laughs> in a row. Or, like, what are we up to? Like, seven hours now. I don't fucking know. There's an episode that's coming that was recorded fucking ages ago, but it's... Was I in that one? Yeah, it was you and me and Moss. Oh, yes, I see the man. Yeah, the audio fucking is... It's broken, but I'm trying to fix it. But, just, you know, excuses, shit happens. Excuses. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. But, that's all right. It's there. I keep uploading the episode. Like, it's actually episode four. But... Mm. Which, which pushes everything up. We'll see. It'll fix itself eventually. But okay. it's only a problem for me. That's it. No one else. Yeah, it is a lot easier to be a guest. Oh, oh yeah. It's a big burp. Who do you reckon your next guest is going to be? I don't know. It could be yourself. You could, could do be. one of things where it's like Joe Rogan and Ro Jogan. Yes. Or Jordan Peterson. Do you know how Peter much fucking effort is to... Oh, no, I was just I was imagining myself just going to each microphone. I could just not could do just that. You could just not do that. I could just stay just in front of the scene. Yeah. No, there's no, there's no video footage. Yeah, there is. Of this. No, 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 no. I'm not like Joe Rogan. Yeah, obviously the Joe Rogan one has footage. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know how. Every single episode Joe Rogan is brought up. Is he? Yep. Every single one. Even once I'm not in? Yes. We didn't, actually, it was my idea to start one of them with the moss just going, <laughs> it's the Joe Rogan by day. Uh, See, his one was deformed from the original, and yours was deformed from his, so eventually it's just not going to sound like anything. Or it's going to sound exactly perfect if you make it like a it's bell gonna, It's going to devolve so far it goes forward. That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In theory, in theory, of course. I think that's pretty genius, man. Mm. I don't say that's other than that. Yeah, it's, it's, um, yeah. I was actually, I was listening to Joe Rogan, um, he had a Mr. Beast on. Did he? Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. Yeah, it was good. Um. Most of the time was Mr. Beast talking. Well, Mr. Beast would have got some heat for that as well. Why? What do you mean? <laughs> it's Mr. Beast on Joe Rogan. So? Who gives a fuck? Yeah, exactly. The people <laughs> who go on Joe Rogan just get heat for no reason. So, you know the, these people you talk of are a very small vocal minority? I would say a medium vocal. Hmm. Like, a lot of people just generally just around just don't like Joe Rogan. Because of, you know, the vocal minority sure have made them a, de- a medium mm. thing. He's still doing what he's doing, so it doesn't matter. No, exactly. It doesn't yeah. matter. No. Um, uh, you need to fill the spaces better while I'm drinking. Or I gotta drink while you're talking. Because that was not good. You wanna do that? No, I'm not. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna leave it in. You're like, I just can't be bothered. That's correct. I'm, That's not, even right. gonna, I'm not gonna look at... I'll, look, I'll visually look at the timestamp, but I won't. I don't know when you're gonna stop talking. Yeah, I don't know. Have, well, I don't know when you're gonna stop talking. Have you seen the Joe Rogan podcast with fucking... Neil deGrasse Tyson. Which one, and why'd you pick such a boring one? Uh, exactly. So there's a few of them. Yeah. And he just won't stop talking. Yeah. And then occasionally, very rarely, Joe Rogan will try to like jump in, like, "Oh, actually," and he's like, "No, shut up." And he's like, <laughs> and Neil deGrasse Tyson just keeps interrupting. Then Joe Rogan just looks so angry because he's like, "Ah, it's been like 50 minutes. This is ridiculous." <laughs> <laughs> I'm listening to it, and I can just hear him getting angry because you can yeah. feel the awkwardness, even if you're just listening to it. I don't know how far behind on episodes you are, but when did you listen to that? Oh, that was like years ago. Okay. And that's what you, that's what's taking up space in your mind. It's TikToks and Joe Rogan Neil moments. Neil Tyson, specifically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you should listen to, um, there's ones that uh, Darren and I both listen to. When he has his comedian mates on, and they just talk shit like this, but better, obviously. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's, those are the good ones. Yeah, I, I go through and I just listen to, like, specific ones. Although I have other podcasts that, like, and I like Joe Rogan's one, like, it's, it's okay, but, like... You like who a lot? You slowed that out I very... I like Joe Rogan's there one, but... There's some other ones that I just personally prefer and I just don't have time to listen to both of them. I have yeah, to pick. Bullshit, no time. What you do you mean? Got time. You got time. I'm a full time. I, oh, I know your on. schedule. Your ears aren't doing anything while your eyes and hands are doing other things. I, that's, that, yes. What? Yep. If your ears are free, you can be doing things as, I've got to stop clapping in front of the microphone as well because my hands were just falling there. If, oh. because, no, but that doesn't work because if I'm paying attention, I'm not paying attention to what I'm listening to if I'm trying to focus on something I'm reading. No, you gotta, you gotta split your attention immediately in, on, in half in on intervals. both. Yes, exactly right. One eye completely watching whatever I'm No, no, you don't have to be watching it, you just have to be listening. 
If your, ear, if your ears are free, you can listen to things while you work. Okay, the only time, one, I can't do that in an office. That should be the time that you can do it. I agree. Yeah. But I can't. Why not? Because. Because. You go, because like, listening to music would be very unprofessional. <laughs> I think it's stupid. You're already, you're already in the office. I think it's stupid, you're right, but... Is, what, is everyone pretending to be professional in front of everyone who's also pretending to be professional? Yes. If no one is, then it doesn't matter. If anyone outside the building thinks anyone inside is professional. It's more you're doing your job. If, if, you're, if, you're, if your work gets done, I don't see the problem. Yeah, I agree with that. Mm-hmm. Anyway. Yeah, yeah, we got off topic, and I don't know where we're going with that. Well, there's extra notes, good thing. Oh, yeah, 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 there was. Uh... So, I heard you had a dream recently. Oh, no. <laughs> yes, yes. Without, so, pretend that you haven't told me that you had a dream, and then just surprise me. Well, I have some brand new news you haven't heard, and it's yeah, a dream right. that I had. Wow, you had a dream? You sleep? It was, a, it was a, I, well, you know, occasionally, and when I do, I have some crazy dreams. So, this dream, I was traveling from Sydney. Okay. And... I'm going through, and I, I, I'm rush. I'm rushing to pack, and you know, I, I, it's, I, I guess I must have been late for something, and I'm just throwing things in the bag, and in, 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 in a backpack, and I, and I go to the, and I go to the airport. I then put the things in security. I, you know, take off my jacket. I take my keys, my wallet, my phone, and I put it through the bag in a separate tray. Right, this isn't this 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 dream. But nothing, uh, nothing interesting has happened just yet. Are we getting to? We're getting to it. We're okay, getting good, to it. Good, good. Because I, f- I forget my dreams all the time, right? And they must be boring like this so far. But since it's, you've remembered it, there must be something it, that I'm alluding to that I think has happened in this dream. No, no, it's, it's, <laughs> a, it's, a, it's a fictional dream. Yes. Okay. All right. All right. What's happened? What's, what, what happens next? So you unload your jacket. I unload my jacket. Yep. And then what happens is I... You don't have to whisper, by the way. There's no one else okay, around. Okay, I need you to edit this part out. Because I'm about to say I regret saying... Okay. Can you just, like, say the word? No, I can't change it. Like, you can, like, can, how about you just say... Okay, like, this kind of, what if you just say, like, Adelaide, but your voice, and you say it like that over my voice in that one section? No, because like, now you completely fucked it, so you're gonna have to, we're going to have to start again from, hey, there'll, there'll be a spot where I stopped talking, and I'll say, hey, you uh, a dream? And you're like, ah, yes. Okay, fine, you'll cut this all out? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So, wait, 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 give it silence for three seconds. So I heard you had a dream recently. Oh, this dream. <laughs> this fictional, non-real dream. Yeah. Don't, don't question the logistics about how I heard you had a dream, and this is the first time that you're telling me about this dream. This is amazing. Yes. I. This is the first time he's hearing it. Yes. I was on a flight. Before the flight, Yes. I was in an airport. Okay. Before the airport, I was rushing to pack. Okay. All right. Good. I was flying from Adelaide to Brisbane. All right. Or any other location. Doesn't matter, it's a dream. Exactly. Where to, where from, doesn't matter. Okay. Now, I take, I go, I'm at the airport security, I must be in a rush, but I'm taking off my jacket and- This better be one of those dreams where you piss yourself at the end. I, I, I wish. <laughs> and basically did. Okay, okay. I take my phone out, my keys, my wallet, I put them in the tray, my backpack in a separate tray, I put it through, I and I realize, oh I've no. I've been to an airport before. Well, I know how they work. I don't know if dream airports are different. Dream airports are not so different. Okay, good. This is good to know. I step through, I do the thing where you got to- when you got to stand on the weird weight thingy and the, 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 the upgraded metal detectors, I and I realized in my bag, oh no, in my dream, I had dream weed. You had dream weed. I had dream weed <laughs> in my dream backpack. Yeah. And I've, it, I've put it through security. What do I do? I'm like, they're gonna see it. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna, I'm gonna ask because I'm like, excuse me, um, ma'am, I believe I left something in in my bag that I shouldn't have. I'm not too sure, I packed it really quickly, but it might be there. She said, that's something I shouldn't have left in there. She's like, oh, well, like an aerosol can? I'm like, there could be some cannabis <laughs> in the back. And I'm so nervous. I'm so, like, I'm so you're done. drug smuggling. You say, wait, at this point, do you know it's a dream? Like, you know how some people are conscious of... A lucid fact- dream? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So were you aware of this? Or, like, or did it feel like a real sort of event? It felt real, but it was still a dream. Okay. Okay. You know, it felt it felt extremely real. I'm but trying to just was... figure out where your head's at when you're trying to I smuggle know, drugs across an unnamed border in a dreamscape. I could have been in the same state. Yeah. Yeah. Town borders. Yep. Yeah, you could have. Why is there an airport on a town border? What do you mean? Oh, you're right. It's dream logic. Yeah, that's yeah. right. Okay. All right. Just I never thought about that. You nearly always fly state to state in Australia. Interesting. Yeah. Anyway. Yep. 
I'm like, oh my god, oh shit! I'm, gonna go I'm, to, I'm dream panicking, man. I am go dream, dream panicking. <laughs> I'm gonna go to dream jail. <laughs> my dream, my dream family's gonna disown me. I... You're gonna have dream fines, and you get sent to the dream electric chair. Oh my god, it's gonna, it's, it's tragic. And it's gonna be a dream hassle. I say, I said, oh, I'm the other guards. I'm like, yeah, no, he's like over there. My, some of my other bags are pulled aside anyway, and my jacket's pulled aside. Mm -hmm. But that was just, then they just let me take that. I think that was just a coincidence. Okay. And I'm like. Oh my god, um, like, I, I accidentally left. From when I was with a fr when I was with a dream friend, I left some dream cannabis in my dream bag. And he's like, okay, don't worry, like, I'm like, what? And he's like, oh, we'll take, we'll take a look, hold on. And then he's like, then I tell the other guy, because he walks away and someone was checking the bags, I'm like, I believe there's some dream cannabis. Yeah. Okay, now, at what point did the person checking for the dream this, weed... I'm here. They changed the gender. No, 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 I, there's like, there's like four different people. Okay, okay. So you didn't... Yeah, yes, yeah, right. You, you were speeding through it, and it was hard for me to follow, so it was going to be hard for other people to follow. Okay, yeah. yeah was, so then another person who's, who's then checking the other bags was many different dream security people. Okay, and, and that's strange. Is there normally this much dream security in a dream airport? I maybe. Maybe, okay. Um, I'll have to dream visit. Yeah, well, you should. It's, mm -hmm. it's, it's lovely this time of year. I, I wasn't able to appreciate that because I was dream panicking and dream shooting myself and dream okay. hitting myself. Yes. So. <laughs> you know, it's actually very common if you dream shit yourself that you shit yourself in real life. Sure. Yeah. 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 And basically, um, he says the, the, the other dude says, "Oh, he's got some weed in his bag," and I'm like, "Ah, uh, uh, shit." And <laughs> this dream was a, this was a dream mistake. It was a dream mistake. I'm like, <laughs> and so he's like, "Okay, well, we got some through." I'm like, "Um, we're gonna scan again." I'm like, just heads up, I've got two laptops in there, mm -hmm. um, two dream laptops, and. That might, maybe that's affecting the scanning. Maybe, I don't know, because he said it didn't scan anything at all, even the drugs. And I was like, who put it through again? The dream drugs. And... I know you're trying to speed through the story, but can you... Okay, slow down. Make it clearer. It. Just clearer. And so he scans it again and again. And I think finally he's like, right, well, where would that be? And I'm like, where would it be? And I'm like, uh, the front pocket, just there. Um, if it's there, it is. Because I, I didn't remember. Or no, I couldn't remember. Maybe it wouldn't be. Yep. And I'm like, yep, there so it wait, is. So wait, are you sure? Are you not sure? I see it. I see the black bag. Okay, so he's, you know... he's opened up the front pocket. I'm okay, like, all right, it's all right. there. And um, it's like, it's in a smell-proof bag. And he's like, um, he's like, did you pack the bag? I'm like, yeah, but they're not my laptops. Uh, there are friends. Actually, hang on. You brought up an excellent point. I don't remember any smells from any dreams ever. Exactly, it's a smell-proof dream bag. No, 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 but so there's any, no smells. any dreams ever in the past, however many decades I've been alive for, I don't remember a single smell from any dream. You remember a dream from any dream? No, I, I, I remember a couple of dreams, hmm. but no, but specifically, never remember a spell. Uh, no, you're, spell you're the oddball here. Yes, yeah, because yeah, I don't remember dream smells, smells from dreams. Dream smells from dream dreams. Yep. Real dreams. Yep. Uh, other real dreams. We've anyway. said dream so many times; it doesn't even sound like a real word. That's right. Now, he's like, "This is this is where the this is where we get to the the dream kicker." He says, "So that your two laptops." I'm like, oh, so, so, sorry, um, did you pack the bag? I'm like, uh, "Yeah, but they're not my laptops. Um, they're just a friend's. One of them's mine. But the other's with the friend's." So, yeah, you've got dream and laptops from yes, your friend. They're the scanning ones, okay. and more of an enemy. But mm -hmm. anyway, he then says, "It's not. A, it's a, you're free to go." I said, I'm, I'm dream free to go. You're dream free to go. It's an odd choice of words. And I, I said, dream, dream, dream me said, but what about the stuff? In the, what, about, what about the dream stuff in the dream bag? Yep. And he says to me, it's not illegal to have two dream laptops. There's no crime being broken. I'm like, what about... Well, he has a point. I mean, I don't, I'm not familiar with the dream laws. Well, he, he says to me, apparently, he says, uh, apparently quite similar. Then I'm like, what about the, the location that I'm going? Like, wouldn't they give you upset? He's like, is where you're going, the dream location, for example, this case, dream cans, do they have, is, is it illegal to have two dream laptops there? I'm like, no. He's like, you're free to go. It's not illegal <laughs> to have two dream laptops. I'm like, he's like, you're free to go. Two dream laptops isn't illegal. I'm like, what about the other stuff? The two laptops are not illegal. I'm like, okay, have a nice day. He just starts dream shouting at you. Yeah, and I'm like, <laughs> goodbye. And I'm just in the airport with the dream cannabis. And I'm like, I've, I've declared it. I've said, hey, and it's only a really small amount mm -hmm. in this dream. So you've, you've smuggled drugs in your dream. Yeah. In my dream, I smuggled these drugs. And it was a crazy dream. I can't believe you got away with this, to be honest. I know, I thought the dream, I was going to catch up, the dream thing was going to catch up with me, but mm -hmm. yeah, that was some crazy, that was a crazy time. And this happened, maybe, I had this dream maybe six years ago. 
Okay. Maybe, maybe eight, six, six, seven years ago. So why am I only just hearing about this dream now? Well, you brought it up, not me. Yes, because I heard it just now. Yes, when you said, hey, I've got a dream. And I was like, ah, yes, no, I No, you said. No, no, that's not true. What's your dream? This is the gaslight segment <laughs> of the podcast. <laughs> My point is, don't look into this dream because it happened so long ago in this dream dream that even if you could track dreams, it couldn't be... No, that's true. <laughs> that's exactly right. And there'd be no way to, to really properly find out how accurate the retelling of this dream was. It's crazy. Yeah, it's just, it's, it's mental. Right. Now... Now, if that didn't put you to sleep, uh, the episode this episode is actually sponsored by Pepsi Max, so I'm going to go grab... Uh, an- do you want another one? I would like another one. Yeah, cool. Well, I'm going to go grab some more. Uh, what I good th- things do you have to say about Pepsi Max? Uh, can I just make a very satisfying slurping sound drinking a Pepsi Max? No, uh, please. Please just have, have something to input. Uh. The refreshing taste of Pepsi Cola is brought to you by our microphones, paid for by Coca-Cola. Now, this will not be brought up by the other sponsor, but he is, it's his favourite. He absolutely loves the refreshing taste of this cola. Yes, this Pepsi Max. I think it's actually called Pepsi Cola. The refreshing taste of Pepsi Cola. Yes. Oh. It's also very important that he doesn't listen back in this for what I said or whilst he's editing. I'm going to make a note of the, of the time mark just to be sure. No, 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 he won't check it. Yes, I will. No, no, he'll just upload it. Right, if I write a, a uh, marker right now, then we will be able to see. Later on. There we go. Although, audience, you should know what I said was actually a lie. It is not my favourite, the thing that I listed. It's the actual primary sponsor, which is unfortunately our primary see, sponsor. See, I trust you to provide uh, the advertising space with... Um, <laughs> what are the words? With uh, the right uh, content, the right, right right words, right things to say, I can, to properly endorse this product. I confess the truth, that our sponsorship was sponsored by none other than Coca-Cola. God damn it, <laughs> I, that's it. That's it, this is a betrayal of this house. You walk in and I'm just like, and he, and he absolutely loves this particular cola, and you're like, that's right, I love it. <laughs> I've been tricked, <laughs> and I will not stand for it, but maybe I'll leave it in, we'll see. <laughs> All right. Could have slept up for an Easter egg. I'm like, yeah. I don't I want to see his reaction otherwise. Yeah. Well, yeah, I would have messaged like, oi, what the fuck was this? <laughs> well, actually, here's a, here's a funny thing. I forget, like, because when they're recorded and when they're released is so far apart, um, I forget what's been said. And it's like, I'm listening to it. And I'm like, wow, I agree with these guys. Wouldn't you agree, just Tom? Oh, I agree completely. Yeah. Like, you're just sitting there, you're listening to it. And like, wow, this is actually pretty fucking good. This happened to me on recent occasions. Yeah. I was... So I'm going to show this to 10 of my friends. Well, I completely forgot my entire political philosophy. Mm-hmm. Like, if only there was a digital manifesto and I just listened to a random podcast. And this this man, this revolutionary, quite frankly, really spoke to me quite deeply. It, 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 it touched my soul mm-hmm. and it realigned my political chakras. All right. Well, speaking of, of uh, touching, so I've got a story for you. All right. Now, I think you, you've heard of this in the past, but this is a pretty good retelling, I think. My email address. Your email address. Yeah, you're very familiar with the one that was made when I was 10 years old. Okay, zigzagzog at hotmail.com. Mm-hmm. Now, there's actually a story behind this email. And the story goes as such. So, when I was younger, um, my my dad, right? Just doesn't remember his kids' names, right? Sure. Is So, Mr. Musk. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> we'll, we'll refer to it as Mr. Musk from now on, right? Yeah. Either a drastic compliment or a drastic insult. Yep. It's, it's, uh, it's a choose-your-own-adventure. It's got nothing to do with the names. He's just got files pending against him from the SEC. Yes, that's true. So, Mr. Musk does not remember his children's names. So, instead of saying the names, he goes... All right. I just filed. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Zig and Zag, right? As, as like, basically summoning spells to summon the kids to go to the front door when it's time to leave the house or whatnot, right? Mm-hmm. So, myself and my sister, Zig and Zag... And these were actually named after some clowns from the 80s. Oh, they're funny clowns. Uh, I like yeah, clowns. yeah, they won, they won awards. They I, won awards. Like they got the recognition they deserved. The recognition they deserved. Yes. You know, that's what I like to hear. Yeah, 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 good. So right. it was uh, Zig and Zach. Now, um, the third kid came along, my younger sister, and my, uh, Mr. Musk goes, oh, shit, well, what are we going to do now? We've already taken up Zig and Zag. Uh, fuck it, Zog. 
Mm. So when the email was being made, it's like, all right, cool. Zigzagzog at hotmail.com. And it's like, oh, cool. This is great. Until years later, we find out the actual history about Zig and Zag the clowns. Oh, no. Now, uh, turns out Zig's a pedophile. <laughs> A pedophile clown. A pedophile clown. That's the most terrifying kind of clown. Yes, it is. So, uh, that's not good. And I, I've regularly given this email out to many people. The man who, from my completely random knowledge that I just have, sexually assaulted his granddaughter seven times. Yes. If I, this is a, that's a complete venture and guess, because yes. I don't know this story. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, funnily enough, that guess is incredibly accurate. <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> that's amazing. What I, I don't know how you guessed it. You know what? You should enter in the lottery tonight. You Maybe know, you'll win. I don't. I hope it's not the clown. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, so, yeah, the, like, one third of my email is a fucking pedophile. Which is, is pretty funny. Now, which out of the nicknames, which one were you again? Uh, you yeah, before? yeah. So, uh, un, uh, it's it's a complete coincidence. Now, I'm not saying that I'm, I'm a pedophile. I'm just saying that the name well, of the clown that was associated with me when I was younger was, in fact, the pedophile clown. That email is far too unacceptable and inappropriate. What's your new email address you're using to replace it? Uh, it's It should be... Barnsley podcast at gmail.com if you want to e- email the show i i don't know no i don't think anyone wants to do that yet but i don't i haven't said it no i've said it one other time and forgotten every other episode i won't lie i was just i was just hoping that you were just gonna just pile onto the joke and just say um of course it's too inappropriate the new one bill cosby at yachtmail.com <laughs> yeah no 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 that's too far that's too far that's oh, it's too like... far the one who just sexually assaulted i guess if you're to rate sexual assault as is better, worse, less depressing, more depressing, how do Maybe, you- Maybe, I don't know, it depends on the, the assault, I think. What, what kind of, what, how do you calculate these parameters? Yeah, it's really hard to, you'd have to have some sort of, I like, f- ethical degree. I feel like Jordan Peterson trying to figure out climate change, he's like, it's everything! <laughs> no, no, no! <laughs> <laughs> Didn't you have a Jordan Peterson impression? Oh, it's only, I gotta do really specifically, a lot of people have Jordan Peterson impressions, but- yeah, it's it's hard to do. I'm probably gonna fuck it up, but mm-hmm. we'll see. Because uh, Moss, Moss was giving me shit for I'm um, not doing voices and impressions, so I was like, I'm gonna just pass this on to you. Like I, I tried to the main the main problem in philosophy with Moss is he doesn't understand that if you want to hear people do impressions, you need to do impressions yourself. This, he needs to he needs to clean his room if he wants to if he wants if he thinks he deserves health care he needs to clean his room otherwise he cannot speak about it. This just sounds like you, but vaguely Irish. Yeah, that's Jordan Peterson. Confirmed. Perfect impression. <laughs> I wouldn't know. I haven't really i I haven't heard him speak in a while, so we'll we can we can review after it's this. Fair. Yeah. Oh, look, it's uh, it is what it is. You know, you look at me. You're just looking at me. Like, say something funny. I'm like, what are you going to do here? I gotta just <laughs> Go think of do you. it. You're a comedian. I'm just yes. a dude. Well, you know, that's too bad. If you're on my show, then you do what I say. Mm. That's the rule. It'd be funny. Yes. It's an episode of Family Guy when they're filming a show, and he's like, Joe's playing an actor. He's like, all right, Jonah, you're gonna get up out of your chair. You're just gonna walk. He's like, I, I can't do that. I'm a handicap. <laughs> and he's like, well, your character can walk, so get up. <laughs> he's like, oh, of course. <laughs> Gets up and walks. No, that's right. That's very funny, actually. Well, you were like, ah, oh, so I'm a Family Guy. Ah, oh. but then it was okay. It was okay. Yeah, it was fine. You bring up Family Guy a lot. I like Family Guy. Yeah, I think it goes a bit beyond. I like Family Guy. Fine, I really like Family Guy. Might go a little bit beyond. I really. I like. love Family Guy. There we go. What do I... Well, I don't know. I don't know. I just... What do you like... expect me to go with that? What, what... I don't know. It's... Look, you bring up Family Guy a lot. I just was... I bring up a lot of things a lot. Yes. You know, we have not talked about Russia or Ukraine once in this entire thing. Nah, it's not It's not relevant world of news. At this point in That's time true. of release, it, the war has ended, fuel prices have uh, halved, and... Uh, halved right back to $8. Yes. Uh, and... What, what else has happened? Um... Uh, China uh, officially declared uh, Taiwan to be a real country. That was big. That was a, no. It was, it was, it was Taiwan. They it was amazing. They just pushed back and they took over China. China's now just West Taiwan. Well, see, I, I did. I was going to leave out the the nitty gritty political details. Well, about I see. It. Yes, but uh, <laughs> the, the circumstances of which China having to say, "Hey, Taiwan is a real country," uh, meant that you know. Uh, look, it's 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 a bit it's a it's a gray area of history. All right. We figured out 
how to completely reunite and and how to really reinvigorate the the, uh, the peacefulness between Russia and Ukraine. Mm-hmm. And that was by just reinstating the Soviet Union. Yes. It brings them back together. <laughs> one big happy family. Like a jigsaw puzzle. Teamwork. A Russian-shaped jigsaw puzzle. That's right. But with a little extra pieces. Yeah. And that was the only way, really. Yeah. And once they achieved, that problem solved. Everyone's life went back to normal. And that was that. You'll see. Yeah. You're going to see. Uh, this, this is going to age very well, I think. Yeah, I think so too. <laughs> <laughs> Just like on the day of release, like the, no, actually the next day, just like someone gets nuked. Um, th- th- that that could still count as a win for us. It's the yeah. USSR. Just yeah. a win back to the Cold War would technically be correct. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right. Any other notes? Uh, yes. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. There are notes. There are. This is what we call a natural transition uh, into one of our classic segregations. Yes, segregation. Yes, that's. Well, you say seg. I say. Seg, and then you say purgation. Yeah. Yeah, all right. So, wait, you say seg, and I say... No, I was including my stutter as the only we both do. So you say seg, I say seg, and you say purgation. No, I don't agree to this. <laughs> <laughs> See, it's like one of those shitty couples ringtone... Oh, no, to the text tones or miss call tone things mm-hmm. that they do, except with racism. Oh, wait, like uh, the voicemail? Yeah, yeah, that's one. Why did it take you so long to get to that one? I don't know. I forgot about voicemails. And... <sighs> yeah. You know, funny, um, Moss's voicemail is actually very funny. Is it? Yeah. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to call him now, and if he doesn't pick up, we'll hear the voicemail, and if he does, I'm going to tell him, hey, I'm going to call you again, mm-hmm. and then, uh, not to, like, to hang out the call so that we can hear his voicemail, right? Because I think it'll be a funny bit. Let's just put him on speaker. All right. I hope he doesn't answer the phone. Hello? Oh, hey, so you're on the show, but um, here's the thing. I'm going to need you to hang up the call when I call you again so we can listen to your voicemail. What do you mean? What are you talking about? Well, see, so you're on the show, right? On, on, what, what, do you mean, what do you mean? On the Joe Rogan experience. Yes, that's right. You're on the Joe Rogan experience right now, okay? Uh-huh. All right, so what, what I want you to do is I want to call you back, but I want you to hang up the call when I call you back so that I can listen to your voicemail. Okay, sweet. All right, that's all I want from you. Can you do that? You sure? All right, cool, sweet, thanks. Bye-bye. See ya. I bet he picks up. I hope he does soon. (laughs) I think he answered and then hung up. Okay, I'm not sure if he understood the... uh... But I think if you, even if they hang up... Hang on. I'm busy right now. Please leave me a message. He fucking changed it. How dare he? Never mind. All right. What was it? So it was just like super aggressive. Leave a message and I'll call you back. Not even hi, sorry, I missed your call. Or hi, is this? He just goes, you like, yeah, just leave me a message. And it just goes, beep. And I was like, bro, you got to fix that. And he did, but. <sighs> you can't be that mad then. Well, I I can and I choose to be. Well, I want to circle back. I want to do a quick. What's it? What's it? How do you say segue backwards? Uh, would you say way, way seg, or I'll would you say, say actual backwards? Yagis? Yeah, Yagis? Yeah, okay. Now, that's segue segway backwards, so I right. think, maybe. To what? Yagis? No. Anyway. So, just quickly, with the, with the Russia-Ukraine debate before they reunited in the Soviet Union, and like in The Simpsons, what happened is their currency was devalued so much. And you've seen all around the place about how, oh, they're worth less than a Roebuck now and Dogecoin and all that. I, I forgot about that, actually. There's an even yeah. more impressive milestone. One ruble is apparently worth less than one Clash of Clans gem. Okay, that's a bit weird. Uh, really? That's actually very bad. Um, you don't like Clash of Clans gems? I'm saying I know they're worthless. <laughs> These things are... Liquid gold, just a basically an NFT at this point. But in Clash of Clans, there's actual gold. Yeah, but that's that's worth like that's worth like nothing. And this is worth less than nothing. You're saying, basically, yeah. This is a problem for them, not for us. This is why. No, it's it's not. It's not because Visa and Mastercard at the time, yeah, had banned, uh, have just pulled out of Russia, so they can't pay for anything. So if they're worthless, as if the money's worthless, it doesn't matter if you can't fucking buy anything. <laughs> <laughs> They've solved inflation. I love it. <laughs> 
Well, that's the thing. They've actually ceased copyright pending, uh, sorry, copyright protections for companies that have just left the country, and they're debating doing it for trademarks. So basically, okay. what that means is one of the McDonald's that closed down, you can just walk in there, take it, and just start running it as, as a McDonald's and selling Big Macs and shit without asking permission from McDonald's Corporation. Okay, you'd run out of burgers eventually, but... You can make your own random, but you can make like a random sandwich and just give and someone just to say to Big it, Mac. That's a Big Mac because you have the Mac, the McDonald's is yours. You can say that. Fuck. Any yeah. company that leaves them, you can. Right now, with pa- that's a trademark, so you can't do it just yet. They haven't, they haven't flicked that switch. I mean, they, they hadn't before they became their USSR, but you can do that with our patented content. Oh, awesome. Okay. Well, so, I didn't know that. That's why I think Russia is the place of the future to move. Really, um, there's so many opportunities you don't have to think of. The Apple brand's been established already. Just make your own iPhones and sell them there. Take all the profit. It's genius. See, uh, I don't think that's in the near future, and that's if what we predicted doesn't come true with the uniting and shit. So, like, this is this is two parallel rushes that we're talking about now. I just want to no, no, no this, this is like five minutes before they did reunite. Oh, okay. It's a okay, timeline, okay. you see. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. We gotta, we gotta make the timeline much clearer because I wasn't aware of what was going on. Uh, well, yes, but that's because I'm more informed on stuff. Okay, maybe true, maybe not. We'll never know. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing like, how people just start wearing capes again, and I want that. I want, I wanted people that that's in Russia, that that's in the USSR, but here mm-hmm. I want cloaks to be cool. You can just wear cloaks and pretend that they're cool, making them cool. That's true. I can you just this. want to, you want to have the social acceptance, but you don't want to do any of the work. That's right. All right. Why not? Just also do not any of the work, but just do it anyway. I could do that. Yeah, you could do that. So why don't you? You know, the next time we go to the to the shops or something, I'll wear a cloak. All right. Cool. Did you did you bring a cloak? I didn't from, bring a cloak. You should. Okay. So maybe next time we go to the shops, you should buy a cloak. Where do I buy a cloak? I don't know. The cloak, the cloak store. store? Yeah. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> 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 That's how suspiciously like our sponsor. Yes, it does. Um, there is actually a, a brand of clothing called Cloak. Really? Yeah, mm. there is. I, I'd show you. I'll show you later, okay. if I remember. If not, then this conversation will be forgotten, and then you'll search it up after listening to this. After we've forgotten everything that we said, we've got seven minutes left, approximately, of this podcast. Ah, uh, more or less, maybe, probably more, if you do the math on that properly. Yes, that is possible. However, it depends on how much time you're looking for with this specific okay. thing. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Yeah, it will depend, but we'll see. How about a nice, friendly debate? A nice, friendly debate. Sure. Yeah. All right. Uh, well, recently it was a trend to debate about whether there's more wheels or more doors. Yes, of course. This is stupid. I and I don't appear. Everyone's so stupid because clearly the answer is wheels. Yeah, I think we're on the no, same page. You were there. supposed to say doors because no. we're both saying, "Oh, it's so stupid." Yeah, everyone's so stupid. We're in agreement. <laughs> we're and the, then I okay, say okay. the opposite one. How about you say? we debate against the entire audience, which will be us in the future? Yes. Okay. Cool. So if we both agree on wheels doors? now. Okay, we got to get on the same page now, so they're on different pages right, later. Do toy wheels count, and do drawers count? Drawers don't count, toy wheels do. Wheels are all shapes and sizes, it's the round that moves, and it doesn't have to be attached to something, but if it's a wheel, like a wheel... So circles count? No. Why not? Because that's not a wheel, that's just the shape of a wheel. The wheel's the shape of a wheel? No, the wheel's the shape of a circle. I take two toothpicks, mm-hmm. I put a cheesel, not cheesel, a cheesel? A cheesel on either yep. side yep. of two, and Okay, little cheesel axles. counts as a wheel. This is bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> but drawers do not, because drawers... Uh, so, okay, the door you have to walk into, the wheel just has to the roll. The eyes are the windows to the okay, soul. Okay. No, 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 that's at least window. 16 billion no, 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 doors right there. That's not a window, though. No, 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 we're doing doors, not windows. Doors to the soul. That's not true. That's not the saying. Okay, doors, you have to be able to physically, like, open, walk through, and then close. That's a door. The so, anus no. is the door to the no, soul. No, it's not. No, no. <laughs> let, me, let, me, let, me, let me reiterate, all right? You got to open it, you got to be able to walk through it, and then close it. I think we're getting hung up on the technicalities <coughs> here. So let's discount all cars. Yes, because there's four doors that you can open and walk into, and there's four wheels. Except the steering the, wheel doesn't count. Is it that? What's it called? The st- it doesn't matter. Yeah, it's, it's it was the debate. We're talking in English. Yeah. Oh, no, no, no. We're talking about the specific... It's a steering wheel. We're it's talking round. about the it's purposes, round. not the names. Because by that logic, in another country, if they've got a different name for the steering wheel, then it's irrelevant. You're not basing it on the functionality. You're basing it purely on the names of the thing. It's because it's a round object, this is... and it's used to steer. <laughs> it's to say what direction you're in, right? Also, that we're choosing what direction you've got to go in to do with the wheel. Because that's the device that you're using to turn. Yes? 
You're really grasping at straws no, here. No, I'm grasping at the wheel. <laughs> no, well, you can argue there's a spare wheel. Yes. But there's also the boot. Which is... Not a, a door. door. Mm, it's more like a drawer. You can't say the steering <laughs> wheel is a wheel. Yes, but the boot because it's is, in the name. But the boot is not a door. No, because it's, it's not called a boot door. But you're not talking about It's not about called a back names. door either. Which? It's called the boot or the hatchback. So you're saying... If I make up a random object and I name it, I call this wheel. I'm holding a piece of wood. It's it's just a, it's just a rectangle. I call this the wheel wheel. D this is the wheel. this is the biggest wheel. Define a wheel look, that fits into. Look look at this. It's a. T I call it shitty wheel. I was gonna tip that one. Uh, watch this. That's a wheel now. No, it's not. That's a it's, can. It's, watch. See, it's round and it moves. So because you made the definition so loose, I had some rules. Right. The rules were it's round shaped. It rolls, or turns, and look, it's called a steering wheel. Fine, the door is an entry or exit to something. Mm. Drawers still won't count for you. Why? Because what, you want to enter the drawer? Yes. No. How do you get the stuff out of it then? You put your hand in, you take something out. What about a locker? A locker door? Lockers, I'll say yes. Drawers, I say no. No, why? It's just a smaller locker. Uh, okay, discount them because the drawers have wheels in them. No, yes, most do. drawers don't. A I lot of new ones. Now. Yeah, a lot of new ones oh, do. Sure. Okay. But if you take most drawers in history, mm -hmm. you just grab out the thing, and it's just. You're talking about past history. We're talking about current doors versus wheels. Since the USSR <laughs> was being reunited, they're going back to making the old shitty ones. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> That's, that might be true, but that's only one country out of however many. It takes up, like, a third of the people. That's not true. It's got Ukraine, it's got Kazakhstan, it's got Russia, <laughs> it's got Estonia, it's got... I nearly said Botswana. Bolivia. Yeah, 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 okay. Latvia. Alright. The all right. Baltic, all the Baltics. Yep, okay, well, look, okay. The skateboard over there, right? Mm. Those wheels count. Skateboard wheels. Uh, yeah, I'd say they count. Okay, so why wouldn't the steering wheels count? Because you don't grab your skateboard wheels with your hand and turn them. No, that's just the function of the thing. Look, if you had, you could put, you could swap the tires of your car with the steering wheels, and it would still go or go slower. Okay, you could swap the, t the you could swap the center of the console of the wheel of your car with a steering with a fucking frisbee. Therefore, a frisbee is also. A wheel. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> You're just using the dog argument. <laughs> What was the which dog argument? The zoo dog argument. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Every, Every animal in the zoo is just it's a dog. Just dog, yes. That's okay. right. Yeah, yeah. No, look. Look, there's plenty of wheels around, right? So, you're saying cars are discounted, except for the one spare tire. So, every car is one. No. There's five wheels of a car. Mm -hmm. Six. And five doors. Mm. So, you're counting the boot as well? Yes. So, completely discount cars? Yes. Alright. Not trucks? Not trucks. I was about to bring up trucks. So some trucks have the two wheels uh, per side. So you know how they've got like eight running along on each side? That'd actually be 16. But what about major cities? New York, eight million people. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. Not that many cars. Everyone takes public transport and trains and shit like that. Okay. That's right? one city. No. I said there's large cities like New York, mm -hmm. London, mm -hmm. Hong Kong, Seoul, Tokyo. All right. And they all they all have subway systems, right? All of those ones specifically, yep. Okay. I didn't and I didn't say I didn't say Los Angeles. I didn't okay. say Washington. All the trains have wheels. I did think about that. Yeah. I don't think no, but legitimately, I don't think they're called wheels. Like, aren't they called like? Oh, fuck. Um, do you know Rand what I mean? Rammed transport objects. <laughs> like, <laughs> kind of like um ball bearings or something. Uh, well, hold on. Let's check. Nah, this no, no, dude, no, they gotta be. It's wheels. Yeah, unless they have maybe the maybe newer ones, but old ones will definitely. No, have rail, railway wheels. That is correct. I'm I'm incorrect. Okay, there you go. So they are, right. those ones there are okay. wheels. However, but no, no, but it's no. nowhere near as many as there would be if it was filled with cars. Right. Yeah. So, but the cars won't matter because now, but now think about this: in those major cities, it's just doors everywhere, layers and layers and layers and layers and layers and layers of doors and doors and doors, empty buildings, non-empty buildings. That's why buildings, I was saying buildings, the wheels. Okay, look, 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 the buildings you're talking about are like office buildings and shit. No, that have apartment filing buildings, cabinets. hotels, and filing cabinets. Yes, the filing cabinets. You say that they've got the drawers, but they have the drawers won't count because they're drawers. <sighs> Actually, in a lot of ones like that, they're not just drawers. They're also like um, like kind of like big lockers, like they're big. Yeah. Uh, what about storage ca storage units? Um, I'd say it rolls up into one big wheel. <laughs> <laughs> uh, a storage door. 
Yes, I'd say that counts. Because it's a roller door. Yeah, roller door. Yeah. Fuck, every house has a roller door. Yes. Uh, well, all of the kind. And every house has at least four doors. Of course, has the fucking front doors, the bedroom it, doors. Right. Shit. That's my point. So maybe... Hmm, this is a bit harder. Right, I think it's doors. Have you seen Monsters, Inc.? Okay, what about Lego wheels? No, but I didn't count those, because they're toy wheels. Toy what, sorry? Toy wheels. Toy. Toy wheels. And I heard the word toy, but toy... Once again, non-functional. No, they are fun. They're... What do you mean non-functional? Oh. They are still wheels, they're just smaller. They're for Lego pieces, therefore, they're still, they're, they're still legitimate wheels. Just because you can't, you can use them, you just... I was on Team Wheel. Yeah. I really was. Yeah. But it was then when I thought about... If you consider it like things like toy wheels, wheels, but then you don't consider the things from like drawers, if you you need to stretch out what is a door equally. As I, much. I clearly define door by being able to open, walk through, and then close. You cannot walk through a drawer. Therefore, a drawer does not. You count. don't have to walk through for it to be a door. That's how I was saying we're defining doors. You can't. What if you're okay? What if there's a step and you're in a wheelchair? You're like then it's not a door. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to that guy, it's not. Okay. All right. All right, all right. Cat doors, for example, right? Huh? That counts as a door because they can they can open and close, and the cat can go through. Just because you can't go through, I can go through. You cannot go through a cat door. Uh, I went through a really small doggy door. That that's a dog door, and dogs are bigger than cats. You've uh, you, oh, there's, there's, there's not this dog. Yeah. Well, okay, maybe, but usually dog doors are. It was bigger. still bigger. It was still yeah. it was still bigger than the cat door. Yeah. What I'm saying is, like animal doors like that count, but Lego wheels have to count. Like toy car wheels as well, all like wheels. That's what it is. It's doors versus wheels. They 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 have to count. But the drawers no. Drawers don't count. But the wheels on the drawers they do. Fine, fine. Then what about post postage boxes? Uh, you open up a little door, you take your mail out, you close it again. To open, walk through, and then close. No, you can't use the walk through. Yes, it's a little can. door. So then locker doesn't count. Alright, we'll say locker doesn't count then. No, it does count! No, clearly. <laughs> you know, it doesn't! We'll say, okay, if that was the clear definition, and the wheel is being able to transport something from We're one location to another. We're clearly boring the audience, we've talked about this for so long, let's just assume that I'm right. No, 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 you're not right though, and it hasn't even been that long. See... One of us always lies, and the other one always tells the truth. That's not true. <laughs> <laughs> but that's still... He could be yeah. a liar. Yeah, 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 but it's not. It's not. No, 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 no. Then that's what makes it so interesting. I think we're going to regret the doors versus wheels thing later. Why? Uh, I don't know. I just got that feeling. I, I don't know. I don't know. Alright. Yeah, just... Any other topics to round out, round no, up that's and it. end off? That's on? literally it. We, like, we ran out. I was like, hey, let's pile it in with different dot points, and we jumped around. And it's just it's just a regular uh, episode. So what? Just dreamweed door, dreamweed doors and wheels? No, no, no. There was um, Bender returns. There was Elon Musk's new kid. There's the pedophile clowns, and then there was the Pepsi Max sponsorship that you fucked up. That you fucked up. I did not fuck it up. You didn't reveal our true sponsors. No, nah, that's not true. <laughs> so Pepsi Max is the real sponsor of the show, and probably always will be. So that would be that'd be good. That'd be actually really good. See, this is where they just send us the other brands and like fucking baby formula and shit like that. Baby for is Pepsi make baby formula? Their pe so Pepsi is mainly their parent company mainly makes snacks mm -mm. and stuff like that. Uh, they make a lot of chips. I don't know if they're in Doritos or whatever, but also things like baby powder. Where do you get this information from? What's your source? Uh, it was all over the news recently, entirely because one, I, I've looked into the, each of the companies, but two, for investment purposes, but two, it's because during the sanctions of the previous Russia before it was the USSR. Uh, Coke, the Coke finally relented, and, and so did McDonald's. They stopped serving all products in Russia, and PepsiCo stopped serving all products except for things like baby formula uh, and stuff. So there's no more Pepsi and stuff. But I was like, yeah, okay, that's good. So at least they're not fucking over the babies. <laughs> <laughs> no. The babies, they don't know what's going on. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so that's how I know about that. All right. Okay. Cool. Yeah, I was gonna call it fake, but no, that sounds like check it's out. yeah, it does check out. All right. All right cool. Well. Any final thoughts before? Uh, just dream goodbye. Dream goodbye. I think that's a very good way to end it. How about that?